Parenting a child with autism has its rewards and challenges, and tonight a play in Columbia County brought living with autism into the spotlight. Eyewitness News reporter Rachel Espiat was at the play. She is live in the Control Center with more. Rachel? Candace, it was a powerful performance, but after the show, parents discussed the reality of having a child with autism. I got pulled for the train. The curious incident of the dog in the nighttime tells the story of a 15 year old boy named Christopher who was in search for the truth after his neighbor's dog died. This play that was put on by the Bloomsburg Theater Ensemble shows the world through the eyes of a boy with autism. To see sort of what the inside of his mind looks like, you know, you, you kind of hope maybe, maybe I can see a little bit of what her mind looks like, maybe that'll help me out as a parent. This story hit home for Diana Lukeski because she also has a daughter with autism. Christopher's story is just one example of the many different ways that autism can impact a person and their family. After the play, Lukeski and other parents shared their experiences. There's so many people out there who are on the autism spectrum, and there's no one set autistic person. I think there's someone out there on the platform looking for you. Lydia St. Clair not only performed in the play, she also has a daughter with autism. She hopes the play and the panel discussions will teach people to be open. The director of the play decided to hold the panel discussions to help keep the conversation going. I'm hoping that the other people who came had a similar experience of just going, oh, I understand more about uh, the privilege of being a parent of this kind of child and the uh, challenges, and I think they are both. Don't worry if you missed tonight's performance. There will be more shows in the next two weeks with even more panel discussions held on Sundays. One will cover autism in the community and another will explore autism in the workplace. In the Control Center, Rachel Espiat, Eyewitness News. Rachel, thank you. And you can head to our website, pahomepage.com, for a full schedule of the plays and discussions.